There's a virus spreading across Pakistan <coughs> and it's deadly, but it's not COVID. This is the virus of fake weddings. And it's spreading far and wide across the country. What's going on? People have got a lot of free time. Why? 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 The internet's talking about it and so are we. Let's get into it. Like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go. I don't know about you, but I feel like Islamic countries are going backwards by about a hundred years when idiots like this pull something off. This is the perfect example of the Instagram crowd that just want a fancy wedding rather than a happy and successful marriage. <laughs> The progress that these countries have made in the last decade or so has just been rewritten because of fools like this. Doing this kind of activity, first of all, idiots, and then putting it online for the world to see. We've got fake weddings that uh, have been in the news. This is basically a group of university students in Pakistan that have decided to throw a fake wedding. So they've got all their uni friends together and they've hosted a full on wedding day that's got a whole build up to it. They've got dance routines, they've got preparation for it. They've got full on professional dancers. They've got the whole thing, okay? It's an official wedding kind of. <laughs> they've even invited fake guests to the wedding. They've basically, people have shown up for pictures and TikToks. That is what we're dealing with nowadays. That's what the world is coming to. Completely missing the point of what a wedding is supposed to be about, what a marriage is supposed to be about. Let's have a look. So you basically got the groom there preparing. So he's basically going out shopping and then they've got the groups together. They've done entrances for the bride and groom, which is so bizarre. They've got, they've got whole, all the traditions. So this is like some traditions going on with the bride and groom. Um, all their friends are there, all their classmates. Everyone's like really supportive. <laughs> They're giving out matai, so traditional Indian sweets. Um, dancing, choreography, people are having a laugh. I get it. I get the buzz and the fun nature of it, but did it have to be a fake wedding for you to be doing this? I don't the bride and groom just on a stage. They've got decorations. They've got the whole thing, man. They've gone for it. Um, annual college tradition. Oh, okay. So it's an annual thing. For <laughs> Lahore University of Management Sciences. So there's a few. Um, so that's the Lums University. So they've done a fake wedding. It's quite dramatic, <laughs> uh, quite theatrical, quite dramatic as you would expect. They've they've really gone out. They've got the full costumes and everything. They've got full Sharanis and waistcoats and everything going on. Money's been thrown, <laughs> dancing. Guests have t are wearing traditional garb. Oh my God. A three day affair. So they've actually gone the whole classic Asian route of doing a three day wedding. Um, Baat Paki, Mendy and Shadi. <laughs> so this is day two of the Mendy. Oh, they've done another entrance. They've got full on entrances, backup dancers, entrances, dancing, waistcoats. I like the waistcoat. Um, <laughs> right. Okay. So the girls coming in, dancing, shock. This is, you've got to give it to them. This is quite brave to do something like this. Uh, both the groom and the bride for them to pull something off like this because they've got to get married at some point eventually and what if their future husband or wife uh, ends up looking at this this video of them being in a in a fake sham wedding um <laughs> how are they going to explain themselves they're so proud of themselves like they've done the biggest achievement of their life so far is this i'm pretty sure that's not why their parents sent them to university in the first place this is Pakistan. This is what we're dealing with now. The modern age of people want trying to be modern. It's so unnecessary. I, I would like to know how many of the girls here are actually married or in the process of getting married. I would imagine not many because they're too busy doing this. <laughs> 
it's quite weird i don't know each to their own but the fact that they went out there is quite brave of them to do especially in this climate for them to first of all do it and then to publicly do it to such a level where it's just gone viral and it's all over the internet <laughs> fair play that's a that's a lot of bravery it's quite bold uh but let me know your thoughts in the comments like and subscribe to the channel if you're new we need to grow this channel baby so uh yeah let me know if you want to see more videos like this and about pop culture and i will see you in the next video peace